Ah, the holiday season. The days grow short, the year draws to a close, carols fill the air, and FT journalists predict what the new year will bring. Making informative prognostications is a bit harder than wrapping presents and guzzling eggnog. In fact, it has taken all of 2017 for our crack team of forecasters to recover from the whipping they absorbed in 2016. The pointy-headed geeks at the FT were as stunned as everyone else by the Brexit referendum result and the ascendance of Donald Trump. We did better, however, in 2017. As we foresaw, Merkel won yet another election in Germany. Marine Le Pen was shown the door by the French electorate. The Iran nuclear deal held together. Jacob Zuma, as of right now, held on as president of South Africa. Inflation stayed tame, oil held over $50 a barrel, China held its currency firm, and Venezuela didn't default on its debt. Or at least, it didn't really default, depending on who you ask. So where did we miss? Well, we thought that Donald Trump would build at least some of that wall along the Mexican border. But all we got was this lousy prototype. And we said that 2017 would be the year that the U.S. stock market rally would finally falter. It roared on. Who made that stupid call? This year, the big calls include, will Theresa May hold on? Will Trump trigger a trade war with China? Will Bitcoin melt down? Will Mueller close in on the White House? Will the AT&T Time Warner merger go through? Put me down, by the way, for yes, 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 yes and yes. But who would listen to me? To see what the real experts think and vie against them in our forecasting contest, look for Forecasting the World in 2018 on FT.com.